This is my review on the Bali Solid Squat Rack. I use it about two times so far right now. It's really, really durable. It has the safeties for your arms. So like when you're squatting or doing the bench press, let's say is that you're basically squatting and then um, um, you actually can't get your way back up. You can just drop it right here on the safety. You can squat down and drop it and leave it on the safety. So what it does is the uh, squat rack actually takes the, the uh, fear out when you're doing squatting, you no know, shoulder press, bench press. So that's a good feeling to have. And it also makes it easier for me to go and train my clients. So it's just like more safer when I have a person doing squats and I got somebody lifting really heavy. And then, and then uh, let's say, say the person couldn't get the weight up instead of me having to grab 300 pounds with my hand like that, you know, so I could just have them to go and just be able to let the weight drop right here, depending on the person's height. So yeah, so it's pretty good. And it has these hooks where uh, you can rack it at different points. You know, so, so with me, since I'm a little taller, when I do my squats, um, this, is, this, is, this is like where I like to put it. And you basically do your squats in here. You know, it's like really good. Do the squats, you use the seat. That's good. Great for doing a shoulder press. You can press with it, work your shoulders. You can tell you can rack it right here. Yeah, so like very durable, very worth it. Yeah, I'm definitely glad that I got it. It took me only like about an hour and a half to go and assemble it. Right now, I'm gonna do some bench press on it right now. I'm gonna heat it up a little bit. So yeah, so. Definitely work training people or just training by yourself. So I don't want my arm like the thing I'm about right here. Let's see how to get the right height. Definitely glad that I got it. Let's see, that's the right height. Let's see. I'm gonna just uh, line it up for my bench press. The only thing is, uh, um, you have to buy your own bench. It don't come with a bench, but so I already have one. This is one of my benches that go incline, decline, and go flat in my car. So, so I already have that, and I like that. You know, that it's not too bulky. And I got enough space here to train people and do stuff. So, let's see if the is good. Let's see. Let's go raise a little higher. Go raise this a little higher. Yeah, so it's about just finding the right height for you. And when it comes down to the safety, I think I'm going to. Uh, let me go one on. I'm gonna raise it up a little higher for the safety for me when I'm doing my bench press. Put it up a little bit higher, a one notch higher. for me about right here so if I couldn't do no more I could leave it right here instead of before you know I'd be lifting 315 really heavy and then it was sometimes that I couldn't get the weight up and I had to like you know slide under I had to let the weight slip off of each side and slide under it so that's like very very dangerous so this is just you know if you can't if you can't get the weight up make sure you're under with the arms with the safeties, you can just let it go 
like that. So that's like very good. You make it so much more safer. And when you get done, you know, just I, I can start off. I I like to have mine about right here when I start because I got longer arms. I'm gonna put on about a little bit of weight. Yeah, so um, it took a it took a while for it to come, but I'm definitely glad that it came. <clears throat> yeah, also to uh, the creeper's base is more fun than workout. So yeah, just uh, taking out the fear makes it better for you to train, and then but without having a spotter. Yeah, so ready for any serious lift if you have space. Yeah, it's like a nice tool to have. Yeah. Here more. Okay, so, yeah, so now yeah, this is the perfect height now. But yeah, so definitely worth the investment if you're really, really trying to push yourself, challenge yourself. You know, if you're a professional training people, you know, just having the gym, definitely, yeah, I like it. Yeah, you, you can also store the weights on this side. Yeah, I have my uh, weight rack over there. But yeah, but yeah, you can also do mu muscle ups too. Yeah, so do this, you know, pretty, pretty much kind of pressing, squatting, and yeah, but definitely the safety is like really good to have. So usually I would only see these at the gym, but now they have it where you can just get it for your private setup. Yes, definitely, if you want to take care of it, it can definitely last you a lifetime.
Yeah, so yes, yeah, so I like it a lot. But yeah, so definitely um later on I'm also show y'all be doing swaps with it too. But yeah. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel for more videos about training in my resistance bands. Customized online training is available on my own Holder Fitness app. Send me an email to contact me for more details.